IL-2 Sturmovic 1946 Bat Mod. If you go to the SAS1946.com site, you will find a great team of modders who have been working on this for quite some time. And if you have already downloaded and installed the Red Core, we are not done. You are not done yet. You see all kinds of information here. We have information to give us a good configuration file. We have information here that can help us with different video cards. And right here at the bottom. This is in such a tiny little thing that it would be really easy to miss. Expand BAP 4.0. Alright, we're going to do that. Proceed with BAT 4.1 to get the Dawn of Flight, the Jet Age, and the Golden Age eras. And you can get these uh, all in one package. Uh, right now, today, we're going to look at something else that's kind of important, and I'll show you why in just a second. DGEN for World at War. We don't have DGEN for the other three modules. But if you have a look at this, this is a very simple thing to do. Make sure that you don't miss it. And here is the reason why. Here's my game. Here's Pilot Career. P38. I did not start in the Ardane Forest. I started with Normandy. Look, 99 missions. I have been playing a P38 campaign, a dynamically generated, for BAT, uh, because of this add-on. We don't want to forget things like this. We want to make sure that we get them. Okay, and if I click on these links that are provided right here, don't forget to install DGEN for World at War. So we're going to click on that. We'll get a new window. It will open up. And we'll see right here that we can download this from here. Uh, if I click on it, I'm going to do that. We'll get a Mediafire link. Notice it's only 43 megabytes. This is you know, fairly small. And what it provides is incredible. So it, after you do that, you'll wind up with this right here now that you gotta realize too that that is that is just a generic name for your root game folder and it's letting you know that you put all of this in your regular game folder with all of your other game files and when you're ready to update it you do pretty much exactly the same thing you uh, let's see Bat DGEN patch 5.0, and you'll also get another media fire link for that. This is really small. This is less than a meg. It's a half a meg. It, it, blink of an eye, and you've got it. And you use the same procedure and just override everything that was there. And when you do that, you'll be able to go to the pilot career, and you'll be able to start a new campaign. It's DGEN, but I want to warn you ahead of time. You can only run one DGEN campaign at a time because it is the main campaign mode for IL-2. Um, if I wanted to, let's say, start a Luftwaffe campaign, all of, all of the DGEN campaigns have little asterisks beside them so that you'll know that these are, uh, these are DGEN campaigns. Don't try to start another one when you've already got one going. Uh, that's never been possible, and we don't want to do that anyway. Because, like I said, it's the main it's the main campaign mode for offline IL two 1946. And uh, once you start it up, you're in it for the long haul. It's a great time, and I've been really, really enjoying myself. And like I said, I'm 99 missions in, and will probably record my 100th mission for a video. Hey, you guys have a great day. Uh, We've really enjoyed the game and hope you do too. Bye-bye.